Thank you very much for joining us on the program and welcome to you. Good morning, Peter. Nice to be here. All right. So World Tourism Day, uh, we've just seen an insert talking about water, its importance and uh, sustainability. And it, it is a very much a part of uh, the theme that the UN has put on the table for World Tourism Day. How important is it for us and in tourism in South Africa? It is important in South Africa, although we've always been known for our natural beauty, scenic landscape, but uh, water tourism is an underutilized part of uh, our tourism offerings in the country. And of course, beach tourism already is big in South Africa for domestic tourism. But this month, we also focus on what else we can do on water. And therefore, we have the short left campaign, our domestic tourism campaign, focusing on that, telling people, go to your local dam, look at all the rivers in South Africa. And from next year onwards, in terms of funding from the side of government, we will also look at those projects to co-fund them with our private sector partners. All right. Now, tourism has been a really good news story in South Africa. It's growing and uh, I'm sure you're excited that you're creating more jobs in the mining sector, which traditionally was the powerhouse in terms of job creation. What is it that we're doing right? Peter, it is going well with tourism. Uh, yes, mining is a very important sector, but now we provide more jobs for people in our sector compared to, uh, to the mining sector, and that is a great achievement. What we are doing well, I believe, is to understand the importance of this industry. There's now a standalone government department working with the private sector to achieve our aims. We have a plan with objectives. By 2020, we want to be one of the top 20 tourism destinations in the world. And we know how many people we want here from which country. We know the money that they will bring in. And last year, we had over 10% growth. The president announced that. And I just looked at the figures for the first quarter of this year. And once again, double-digit growth. So internationally speaking, it's going very well. But what we have to strengthen is domestic tourism. All right, and that's to get our own people traveling within the country. Yes, that's what we would like to do. And already at any given time, 70% of all tourists are South Africans. And they're spending a lot of money, bringing a lot of money into the economy. But let's be honest, because of our history, there are many people who can afford to travel, but they don't yet travel because they haven't grown up being travelers and tourists. And we want to get to those people to say to them, you know what, not only will it be good for you, but in the process, you will also be contributing to the economy, creating jobs for other people. So it's actually something good for all of us. All right. Tell me a little bit about the Lily Zeller Awards, because uh, you're celebrating excellence in the tourism sector. Yes, last week for the first time ever, we had the National Tourism Awards, Lily Zella Awards. And that is to recognize excellence, people who are really achievers in our industry. And it went so well because for the first time ever, all of us could see who are the people in our industry who are successful. And the Ministerial Award, uh, the first one, we gave to uh, Jabu Mabuza, who is really living the South African dream. A young man who grew up in the rural areas, he became a taxi driver, later on a taxi owner, and then he ended up as the CEO of Tsoho Sun, one of the biggest hotel groups in the world. And uh, that, those are the kind of role models that young people out there should see and understand that they can be just as good and as successful. Melissa, we're going to have to leave it there, but uh, thank you very much for sharing your thoughts with us on this uh, very important day, World Tourism Day, and uh, sharing the good story of South Africa. Thank you for your time, sir. Thank you very much. All right. And with that, we go back straight to studio.